is the wise crack in Warframe, and today we're gonna fight the Eidolon Terrorist. Um, yeah, so if you don't know how to beat him, watch this little video. Um, I forgot I had it, so here it is. Let's, uh, let's fight it. Fight the big beastie. But how do we fight this big beastie? Well, as you can see, um, I'm using my mag. Very inappropriate for this fight because you need to get rid of its shield. And um, every time I use my power, I give him his shield back. So don't use your mag. That is a tip for you. So as you can see, he has a little blue bar. That bar needs to go before you can hurt him. And that is its shield. How you? How do you get rid of a shield? As you can see, my weapons don't do a shite. Doesn't do shit. He tries to attack me with shock waves and homing bolts. And yeah, as you can see, I'm doing no damage. My friends are doing no damage. So we're here. And we're trying to figure out how to beat him. And as you can see, some of my uh, friends here are figuring it out. They are using their operators and their powers to get rid of that shield. So um, after a while, I, I finally figure it out. And when the shield is gone, you can you can shoot its weak spots. And after you shoot that weak spot for a while, he gets down. Look at that. And you get this energy spike. Uh, that will hurt you, by the way. So you, you have to be careful with that. He disappears. But don't fear. It will come back, ladies and gentlemen. And get his resources when you kill him. So after a while, he comes back, and you can see what kind of powers he has. He has these uh, homing beams. Yeah, so um, you have to fight him as long as you want. You get all these uh, resources you can uh, use for other stuff, but that's, uh, that's a whole nother story. So here I am, using my operator, and as you can see, I'm now finally figuring it out, and I'm shooting his weak spots. When you shoot his weak spots, the shield will disappear. And then you can shoot those spots and you can get them down again. So that is what we're doing, ladies and gentlemen. We are keep on doing that. Look at that. You can now finally hurt him again. He's going to use a, a special power. Look at this. Oh my god. Here he goes. The shock wave. And let. Yep, that's it. We got him again. We got him again, look at this. Wow. He's really imp uh, yep, did I didn't I say it? That energy spike is dangerous. Dangerous. But remains close by. Right, so as the bastard says, you will you will get back. It's close by and uh yeah, just have to wait and look at that. You can see him already, it's all the way over there. We can find him again for the resources. And those resources are the things I'm picking up right now. Exceptional sentient core. And uh, you can trade them in for standing. And you can get all kinds of uh, cool energy weapons for your operator. Look at that. More intact sentient core. So here we are again. Another, another round. So more chances for more stuffs. So here we go again, using my operator, shooting his weak spots with my beam. Oh my God. Well, it gets tougher and tougher, I guess. And uh, as I said, it's a big bastard, and big bastards are always tough. As we know, because me, myself, am a big bastard. What am I talking about? I don't know. I'm dead again. So here we go again. Just keep on using your operator and look at this. We are at a stage that he uses his special powers. Look at that. A rain. A rain of death. And uh, yeah, those those things are uh, homing as well. They just... They are looking for you. Alright, so... You just keep on doing this and... Uh, yeah. Get all the resources it drops. Look out for the energy spikes. And yeah, there I go again. Yeah, it's, 
it will it will become kind of tedious after a while that's why i don't do this a lot but i thought you know what let's just show my friends how to do it if they don't know you probably do you probably know it even better than than i do but then again i'm sexy so yeah that's why this video So, oh, here we go again. We got him again. And look at this. I'm using my... my I'm being smart now. I'm using my operator powers to uh, not get hit. That's smart, right? That's using your brain. Here we go. So, we did it again. And uh, I was a bit far away. Look at this see a great great panoramic shot of the, the damage this this beast can do look at that look at the range of that attack it's flipping insane so yeah it's not something um, something easy to do i think at least look at that look at the shockwave attack it's cool as well so again using my operator uh, trying to shoot its weak spots i think we're doing great Kill them a couple of times, and uh, yeah, we can see these uh, these blue little things. They drop sentient cores as well, and these are are things that can heal them. But later, more on that. But these uh, little blue things you see flying around, kill those as well. Well, as Uncle said, there are little sentients. And uh, we need to stop them because they want to heal them. Uh, you can see them flying around everywhere. And the way to stop them is shoot them first. They'll get blue and they get shiny. And then shoot them with your operator, with the power of your operator. And uh, yeah, let's do that right now. Look at that. Bam. I shot him. I shot him in the head. Bam. Shot another one. And they drop intact sentient cores. But again, more uh, later about that all right so again more more of these little bastards shoot them first and they get blue and then shoot them with with this operator power and damn it they heal them so again ladies and gentlemen we need to kill him one more time and after that he's gone all the way through so let's do this we know the routine now first shoot with your operator powers Get rid of his shield however you want. I use my, my operator powers. But you can do it in whatever way you want to do it. It's not up to me. Shoot this little bastard flying over me after he killed me. Damn it. And look at this. We killed him all the way through. Oh, yeah. Did you hear that scream? It was kind of sad. I don't like that. But, but then again. I want my Eidolon shard, and I got it. You can see it, that I got it. Yep, I got it. And uh, now then, pick up all the cores you, you can see. See all those little blue bastards flying around still. Got all right, there's one. Got him. Nope, nope, I did not got him. Um, all right, so again, pick all the stuffs, pick, all the, pick up all the resources. Then, uh, well, then we'll go home and we can see what, what we got. Yep, got another one. Alright, so we're here and we can see on the left what kind of stuff we picked up. We got a two exceptional cores and 16 intact sentient cores. And we got one Eidolon shard. So, what do we do with these cores? Well, we go to Kanzu and we go... Uh, left of him and there is a little path and uh, at the end of that path there is a door you go out of your suit or your warframe or whatever and then you get a little cutscene for the first time but uh, I, I will spare you that and then uh, there's this dude what things Anko. are and what they should be are indivisible so we can treat in sentient course for standing as you can see on the left I got 5,000 out of 5,000. That means I get, can get my new title. I need sentient cores for that too. And bam! We done it. Allow us to improve your efficiency. 
Look at this. Um, you got all kinds of stuff for your operator. Isn't that great? So I can pick up a, a suit or cure us for a suit. But I thought, you know, what what is all this? It's an armor design. All right, great. But who really cares what I'm wearing underneath? You know, I'm just I'm just a dude in a spaceship and controlling my warframe so he doesn't need a suit but i do need a new brace or something i can shoot with so um yeah i think this will be great so as i said um this is a new place to get new kinds of stuff but it's all stuff for your operator so yeah um i think this is a great thing what is this uh it focuses energy Semi-auto. It's like an Uzi. It's an Uzi for your operator. All right? So let's redeem it and let's get it and let's get the hell out of here. All right. So, look at this. Look at all this stuff. All new stuff. You can get it by getting all these shards and then uh, collecting them and giving them to Anko. He will, get you, he will give you standing and with that standing you can buy all this stuff. Isn't that great? Well, it's a new way to uh, to start farming again. I don't like it. It's too much. To, it's too much to do. But then again, you know, some people like to uh, give their operators a new suit or some uh, some new upgrades. But I'm I'm not I'm not that guy. I'm a guy who likes just. Uh, what? You talking to me, dude? I was talking to my viewers. Oh, oh, you wanted to show me something else. All right, so you can also name and enhance your amp here. Don't know why you would do that, but, you know, again, everybody has different different things they want to do. And you can even craft stuff here. Yes. Oh, my Lord. You can craft your new brace or arm thing, the thing you shoot with. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I think this is all uh, I can I can show you about this. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Check me out on all my other videos. And I hope to see you there. And until next time, my good friends, deals.